Welcome back to another edition of Office Trivia. We got a new game for you guys today. I know JMO is very excited. Girl. Today we are playing Wavelength. Beautiful. We're playing That's Wavelength great. today. The rules are simple. You one of one member of each team will get a number. Your goal is to try to get your teammate to guess the number. We're going one to one hundred because we're sharp here. What are the teams exactly? So I, I know. Uh, uh, me and JMO. You and JMO. Yeah. Round one. Who's gonna be the person receiving the number? Each team has to decide. You receive. All right. I'll close my eyes. I don't, Hold on. I don't know how right. we yeah. get the word. One person close their eyes. One person get the number. There's gaps in where he's looking. All right, Nick. Your number is. If you're playing at home, don't look. That's your number. Where? Right there at the bottom. It just it, round one. It just it just popped oh, up. Oh, I can't. I couldn't see it. Oh, gotcha. Tony, this is your number. Okay. Got it. Okay. All right, boys. Round one. First prompt. We have to keep our eyes open. Close. No, you can. Yeah, the, number, the numbers. The numbers are. The numbers have been. The numbers have been closed. Go. You can open your eyes. Oh, I can. All right. Oh, bad. First prompt, Nick. You have to name a wide receiver. Mike Williams. Jamal, where where are you feeling? Where are you where you want to be at? Curious. Above sixty. Above sixty. All right. But not a whole lot higher. We'll move. We'll move you up over there, Tony. Wide receiver. I just want to say real quick, did you make this graphic? Yes. This is well done. Thank you. I appreciate a good graphic. Uh, now I actually got to think that of a product talk got to your head immediately. <laughs> <laughs> Love that. I got to actually think of a receiver here. I, I forgot how this game was being played. Let's go with, um, <laughs> sure. Let's go with Corey Davis. <laughs> where, where are you feeling, God? God? Where would you like to be? Uh, give me, put me at like 66. 66. All right. Holy shit. Gut. Around the same spot as Mike Williams. Let him cook. <laughs> All right, round so like two. Gut, do gut things. Round yeah, two. Have to name <laughs> uniforms. Team uniforms. Nick, you want to start us off here? This is such an opinionated thing. It is. It yeah. absolutely so is. Got to be on the same. Got to be on the same wavelength as your teammate. Right. Yeah. I'm gonna give you the Dallas Cowboys. Okay. Where are you feeling, Jamo? Feeling a little bit high. I think we're in the 70s. Okay. Can I can I look up a specific uniform? I won't show gut. I just like I don't know if it's their home or aways. Yeah, that's fine. I'll allow that. I, I don't. Gut knows unis. Saying. Uniforms. I would say the Rams. Maybe specifically their aways. Where would you like to go, Gut? I think we're lower. So give me like. In between 40 and 50. All right. We could do that. Work our way down. Smooth slide. That's beautiful. <laughs> Just All right. down So you so down smooth, man. <laughs> All right. Last, last question of round one. I need you to name me. Team's drafting ability. So how well does a team draft based on your number? Wow. Let's go with the go with the New Orleans Saints. I won't I won't ask for a final answer yet, J Mo. I won't ask for a final answer just yet. Let's let's let the other team submit their their team. Give out okay. For drafting. Uh, Cleveland Browns. Oh shit. Okay. Um All right, go. Do you wanna do you wanna put I in your first will, answer? Oh, do I have to give up my final guess now? Yeah, it's for this for round one, your final guess. Okay, your numbers for yes. Okay. Yes. Dude, Cleveland, Corey Davis, and the Rams away, Unis. Gotta be ass. Give me my final guess is twenty two. Got landing down at twenty two. We're working our way to Alvar Villa. Yeah, Alvar Villa. Cool, calm and collected. All right. Final answer, Jama. Saints I think the Saints are a pretty well rounded team. I think it was the year 2017 that they had Kamara and Lattimore. The year Something that's like really that. in my head. Try not to let that swing me super high. I'm gonna say such a hard one to get. A gr- I'm gonna say 78. 78. All right. Let's reveal the answers. Jmo Nick, your number was 72. 78. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh. You guys hit this for sure. Your answer was 23. Oh, yeah. Dude, when, you oh. said, when you said like 60 something for Corey Davis, I was yeah. like, oh, we're so boned. I'm like, you're thinking yeah. Madden right The Browns right now. recalibration was yeah. clutch. I was like, we got to yeah. fucking tank this answer right now yeah, with the Browns. Yeah. Well, I, didn't, I was so. Like, it's almost like I want to do the first answer way higher than it needs to be and then yeah, like level out. Yeah. Yeah. So you know what side of the board it's on. My question to you guys is should we do best three out of three or should we do total score? Oh, how far you are away from the number. I kind of like total score. It makes the third round relevant. I say this way in case it goes 2-0, the third round's relevant. Yeah. I'm cool with that. So, yeah, the, so they scored one point. So it's lowest score. You guys had one point. You guys had six. Dude, you act like we like got our ass kicked. We were within the same hey, ballpark. Hey, game's still on. Also, game's still on. You guys ready for round two? Your the girl. who had yeah, the number man. last time will be guessing this time. Tony, close your eyes. JMO, your number is? Got it. And got, your number is? Okay. All right. Jamo, you good? Jamo's freaking out. Yeah. All right, you guys are good. Yeah. yeah. Jamo just started bugging out. <laughs> all right. Nobody's honorable. Go, you want to start us off this round? Sure. Go, you have to name an all time quarterback. Don't fucking think about Kerry Collins. 
<laughs> Give me Josh McCown. Oh, okay. I'm thinking low number for McCown. But he has stuck around a while. I'm not going to react too much to it. Let's put it at a cool 40. Cool. It's like week one of the regular season. You don't cool want to overreact. Seems all right. Unless it's 99, don't give me Kerry Collins. I'm going to say... Blaine Gabbert. All-time QBs. Blaine Gabbert. I mean, we got to be thinking single digits at this point. I'm going to start with 12, and we'll work our way down from there. <laughs> we'll work our way down. <laughs> we'll work our way down from 12. Oh, you go so much slower going down. Beautiful. Yeah. All right. Second question of round two. I need you to name me. Head coach. I'll go first? Yeah, you go first. Go. Head coach currently? Currently. Oh, man. Bimbo looks distraught right now. Let's we'll go like a, a Robert Sala. That's his first name, right? Yeah. That is his first name. Okay. What are you feeling, Tony? Mm, Sala has such mixed opinions on. I feel like you said that, though, in a disrespecting manner. <laughs> so, no, no, you're good, you're good. Um, I kind of want to keep it at 40. Okay. I think we're still in that range. Yeah, that's that's totally fair. What do we got, J-Mo? J-Mo. I'm going to go with, it's supposed to be fun, it's stressful. I'm going to <laughs> go with Byron Leftwich, Bucks coach. Is he their head coach? Oh, fuck. He's Todd Bowles. Todd right. Bowles. Same type beat. Can't be much further off from the 12 spot. Let's, uh, Byron Leftwich stinks. Todd Bowles oh. is actually the answer. Byron Leftwich is actually This good. is like in court, you know, when someone says something like, strike that from the record or whatever. Strike but Byron but the jury heard it. Yeah, I'm sorry. You can't pull it out now. No, no, no. I, I was thinking of the head coach. I wasn't really like, like I meant to think of Todd. Yeah, Leftwich is a dog. I just meant to think of the head coach. Like, I, yeah. <laughs> I didn't mean to think of the head coach. Okay, so that makes me think maybe it's a little higher. Unless. Bump it up two pixels. <laughs> One, 14 now? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Last question of round two. I need you guys to name me. Fan base. Let's name a fan base. Upset some people or don't. I don't care. I think we all agree there are certain fan bases that are better or worse than others. Am I going first? Give me. Oh, man, this is tough. Um, cause there's so many mixed feelings that like, oh, my God. <laughs> give me like, give me like, 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 like <laughs> the Titans. It had to be the Titans. Do you work for the Titans? Like. Do you, <laughs> is that good? We love the Titans. Do I have to give a final answer? <laughs> no. Oh, I Just right do now. you think about it. I want, I, want, I want to get their thoughts first. Okay. Uh, I had it at like a 40. I think I'm trending more towards like 35 in between that 30, 40 range. Okay. I don't think the Titans have that strong of a fan base. Uh, fair. Yeah. I'm a Take cook, a moment to think a, about your answer. I'm going marina- to marinate on a little based bit. how strong the fan base is? That's, just for, your, base. that's for your discretion. Yeah. It's all about vibes, GMO. I've, I've had a team in my head since the beginning. I don't, I don't know if Rip it's it. accurate. Like, just, I know the number, and I don't love how it matches up. I'm going to just stick with them. Say the Raiders. Oh, dude. Dude. <laughs> all right. They, all right. they show out. Raiders did him dirty leaving uh, Oakland because Oakland fucking loved them. Right. So here's the problem. They played in a baseball field. The Raiders, <laughs> Raiders didn't love their fans, but their fans historically, loved them. Historically, the Raiders fan base is insane. But there's just no way after you giving me Blaine Gabbert, you went to the other side. And I feel like you going with the Raiders was more of an indication of them now moving to Las Vegas and having kind of like an influx fan base. It's a sharp analysis right there. It's probably so <laughs> fucking off. This number's going to be like 71. <sighs> yeah. He, he actually wanted Blaine Gabbert to be the GOAT. I kind of feel like, because Jamo's knowledge goes back like six years, Blaine Gabbert. <laughs> he just bought all that Blaine Gabbert mojo stock. <sighs> and, and now he's like, Blaine Gabbert's a 95. Dude. Stop. You're fucking with them. I'm not a fucking idiot. What were the other? Okay, so it was Bucks head coach, Blaine Gabbert, Raiders. <laughs> What do we got, Nick? <sighs> Fuck. In fact, I'll um, the final answer. I'll take a final answer? I'll take a final answer. And that one threw me for a loop, JMO. <laughs> You're really stressing about this. <laughs> this is a stressful game. <laughs> my mind is, I, I want to go either 16 or 11. I can't make my mind up on those. Okay. <laughs> Just split the difference. Going for gold or I'm going home. I'm going to play a little bit safer and go 16. All right, Tony, your final answer? <sighs> All right. Um, all-time QB was Josh McCown and Robert Sala and then the Titans. I'm going to say, I'm going to say it was like a cool 35. Thinking JMO, your number was? Let's go! Oh, boy! Let's yes, go. sir! Tony and Gut, your number was? Okay, okay. Dude, not bad, not bad. Nine. Nine. We got a tie ball game now? Yeah. No, oh, no, close. you said 35. I said 35. Okay, okay. So the score is now the fuck up. seven oh, to five. Okay. I like that. Got and Tony still in the lead. Honest, I think Josh. I think Josh McCown is too is not good enough to be a forty. But I think I knew what you meant yeah. when you said Josh McCown. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.
So you guys go, can select you can select anyone for round three who you want to be the guesser. What are you feeling good? You like you like describing you like or better? you like guessing? I'm comfortable in both spots. So whatever you like more. Okay. All yeah, right. Like, all right. I fucked, like I think you did really well guessing and I didn't give great answers. Okay. I'll guess again then. All right. People that have to close their eyes, close their eyes. Here come the rounds. Final numbers. JMO, your number is. Noted. Go I mean Tony, your number is. Got you. All right. Open your eyes. Start off. First question of round three. I need you to name cornerback. Oh, fuck. Switch. <laughs> play, yeah. Let's play a little defense here, boys. No, That's super is, pumped. This is, this is where we get tripped up because the way I think about corners is definitely not the way that gut thinks about corners. Can I ask him if he knows a player? If he knows ball, he knows ball. I can't. Yeah. <laughs> I can't. Speak Don't be what. throwing out players that I might not know. Hayir Elam. I think that's a great one. You like that? Yeah, mostly because I don't know who he is Can I either. Tell what t- you, no. Do you know who? Enough. Nick, where are you feeling? Where are you, where are you feeling like you want to go? You want to just stay put? You know who that is? No. Oh, okay. Okay. Nothing has to be, nothing has to be permanent right now. You could, you could marinate on that. Let's, let's move it down to, uh, let's move down to, to 30. Nick, do you know who that is? No idea. Okay. If you don't know who it is, though, Matt, you know, do you fair know direction. I do know who that is. I almost right. feel like that in itself is right. like a directional right. hint. All right, the corner I'm going to throw out for you, Gut, is Darius Slay. Oh, okay. He was great in his great in Detroit. He's been so far great. He's a little bit older. I already know your number. Give me, put it in between 70 and 80 right now. All right. Second prompt of round three. Need you to name Stadium. Shit. <laughs> this is tough. Brother. <laughs> <laughs> That's two in one video, Jim. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> two strikes. <laughs> it's fu- Just fucking out of control. <laughs> I'm gonna actually go with that. I'm gonna say Hard Rock, the Dolphins. <laughs> <laughs> How the fuck would I know what Hard Rock Stadium is like? I don't know, man. It's your perception. You have the same wavelength as him. <laughs> straight vibes. Straight vibes. Two answers that I don't know what they are. I definitely feel like we're south of south of fifty. Yeah, I'm. I'm I don't know. I'm gonna stay put in the thirties. All right. 30. Whatever. What do we got over there? I'm going to throw out uh, Gillette Stadium in Foxborough. Nothing crazy, but it's definitely iconic. You know, a lot of Tom Brady's homeland. I think I low key, I kind of want to keep it. More analysis. I wanna, there's just not much like to say about it. It's just like a good stadium. It's just, I don't know. I'm keeping it between 70 and 80. It's just solid. Yeah, I think it's solid. Okay. Like nothing too crazy. Yeah. No, I mean, I know the numbers. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Final prompt. Round three. An offensive line. Okay. Nick feels potential here. We need to, like, like something tangible that we can actually. <laughs> Cornerback was tangible. Me and Jameson can wrap some numbers around this one. Yeah, I know who that corner was. I, I have no he's, idea. He's fishing was. for info. <laughs> but strike, if JMO's not the one. Strike that from the record. <laughs> <laughs> if JMO's not the one given to me, then it's fair game. All right, JMO, off- offensive line, what do we got? I don't want to give any info away. I don't know if I should be staying. I'll, I'll just shut the fuck up. Oh, you need to say something. Don't worry. I'll pick up whatever you're putting down. <laughs> <Shut> <laughs> what does Nick need to hear? I think you need to hear this. Just just turn into an intervention. I, I want you to understand <laughs> why. I'm we are like w- our team is emotionally struggling. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to tell you this, Nick. <laughs> <laughs> but the Jaguars. <laughs> but you're lost. Tools are there. Time to build a birdhouse, boys. Let's chirp, Jamo. The Chiefs. What? <laughs> <laughs> the Chiefs dead ass have a top five line in the NFL. So you heard him. <laughs> fucking Christ. Wow, it's gonna be a fucking blender. What he needed. He needed to hear that. He's like, finally, something tangible. <laughs> you just sit there and think. Tony needs to answer. Oh, right. I'm giving out mine before he... Yeah. Uh, I want to just hear a gauge. I want to hear a gauge from where he wants to be. It's, it, it moves slowly on the way up, so just get, gotcha. it, get it going that way. Beautiful. I'll tell you when to stop. Even with them. Boys, O-line. Okay, let's go with, let's go with the Saints O-line. Solid. You know? <laughs> like, again, it's just another... Just like, I mean, top five, I don't think so. But they're definitely fucking up there. Top ten, I would say. I I, I low key just kind of like my spot, like sitting in that seventy eighty range. Perfectly fun. Like I low key just. Would you like to guess first cut? I don't want to. No. Yeah, I had to. Well, I would like you to go. Okay. (laughs) (laughs) Give me. Oh man, I think it's a little higher. It's a little bit higher. Lock it in. Give me eighty two. Eighty two. I think it's a really good guess, cut. So the more I marinated on this, the more I've realized you gave me that Chiefs guess to just recalibrate myself a little bit so i think we were sitting i was in like the 30s so you wanted me to bump it up definitely north of 50 we're definitely not where the trap is currently i don't think would you like to move the trap down 
I will, but let me yeah, let me let me think on the on the range. Give me an unknown cornerback. <laughs> Trap is on the move. Unknownish cornerback. I don't know anything. Stop. Enough. Stop trying <laughs> to distract me. Hard rock. O line Chiefs was something's telling me fifty eight or fifty nine. Let's go fifty nine. Final answers, boys. Gut. Could be so You off. guys Fuck. your number was sixty eight. Gave you a little, a little by, too good of answer. Off by I, didn't, 14. I didn't realize Darius Slayton's game was like that. Darius Slay. You guys That's what I meant. would uh, need Darius. to be within twelve to tie. Damn Nick it. and J Mo, the correct answer was Let's go. Oh, 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 boy. Oh. Wavelength. Oh, the Wait. fucking vibes are high right I now. Totally, I totally forgot what your number was. I thought it was like in the low forties. Baby. Was, Damn it. Was, was that analysis just spot yes. the fuck on? Let's so go, was, boy. Was. When Shit. I said Chiefs, you're like, oh, let's bump them up to 80. I'm like, no, too, too much. <laughs> well, my, my first thought was like, maybe he gave us the same number as like, uh, oh, as just something that. funny. I like, actually debated doing it. I actually debated doing it. That's that. what I thought. So I went there <laughs> and then I just thought about it. And I'm like, cause I've said that so many times, like we just need to recalibrate sometimes. And I was like, that's what he did there. Fuck. Wow. Go. Oh, that was clutch. Electric. I was thinking, I think when you said slay, I was like, dude, that could be like upward. Well, no, I mean, slay got you where I was trying to get you to go. Cause you said like 70, you said like 75 and we're 68. Yeah. I was thinking Pats was like iconic, but like, it's like kind of a today. shitty stadium. Yeah. That, same, that, that was the hard part about the stadium is, like, yeah. there's so many factors of you don't know, like, what makes the stadium Ooh. great. Score of eight through three rounds. That's going to be tough to beat just, like, in the future. It yeah. might be an all-time score that stands for a while. Yeah, yeah, that was really good. Somebody's going to have to beat that. I almost said the Chargers O-line, but I'm like, I don't think that's strong enough. Chargers have a dog shit O-line, don't they? No, they're actually really good. Are they? Yeah. They've had some injuries. Fuck, yeah, but fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I would have went along the same the same line of thinking, though. I probably would have went a little bit lower, maybe, like, 53 or some shit. But wow. Jam was just like, fuck it. We got to get you uh, way up. Up there, yeah. 2018 Cowboys. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys ready to get into some? The Price Woo! is Right, Matt Ryan. Baby. Fuck, that Matt is Matt Ryan, Ryan for it sure. Is Matt Ryan. Yeah, wow. that was getting, that was an easy one. We're getting better at this. It's getting be way better at this. Matt Ryan. It's all Matt Ryan. Oh, the picture? the picture? Picture is. Oh, shit. It's is all Matt Ryan, Triv. Okay. Colts, Matt Ryan. All right. First question. We're doing Matt Ryan's playoff wins. You should know this better than anybody. I didn't have said a word. He doesn't watch the playoffs. <laughs> that is fact. Doesn't that know what fact. goes on in the playoffs. You watch Falcons in the playoffs, like when they make it, or do you just do it out? Just put your number on the board, Gut. Stop looking at my drawing, bro. Do we the same number? Everybody have an answer. Let's take a look. Nick says five. Gut says eleven. Jmo says five. Correct answer is four. Let's get it. Wins for Matt Ryan. One <laughs> point for Jmo. One point for Nick. I the high ball. High ball. It. Matt Ryan was not like that. <laughs> Don't get it twisted. I was thinking the Super Bowl run. Is that like question two? Run? What do you think he won 11 games in that playoff? Matt Ryan's single game high in yards. Stink. Oh, I know this. You mean you know this? He knows you know it. what, idiot? Apparently he knows it. J-Mo's showing the camera. He's confident. Act like I didn't write it down already. But I know you'll change your answer. Why would I change my answer to what you have? Because you know I have the right answer. You're a bot. It's a way to do it. <laughs> <laughs> just felt right <laughs> as I was writing it. Everybody oh. reveal. 444. 444, 425, 501. You got a 500 piece. The correct answer is 503. <laughs> Sharp Ish. guess from JMO. Takes the lead 2 1. So we move into round three. We would be guessing Matt Ryan's single season high in passing touchdowns. Nick's going to a place to find this. Girl. Waiting on that second digit from Nick. Nick's trying to take himself back to Where in the 50s that, those years. All right. All right. Everybody reveal. 39, 45, 38. I think it's 37. I don't know if he had a 40 or not. The correct answer is 38. Oh, fuck. Sharp guess again from J-Mo. Damn. Takes a commanding 3-1 lead. No, I knew Matty Ice like that. Apparently, apparently you do. Oh, Question awesome. four. Matt Ryan's season high in interceptions. They're, they're quick over there, man. They got you. I'm not worried about speed. Everybody reveal. 14, 15, 22. 22 Ooh. is crazy. Correct answer. All right, Matt. 17. I believe that's good. Fuck. Go with yeah. a point. W. Score is now 3-1-1 to one to one in favor of JMO. Somebody's got to... Got to start making a, a difference three, here. One, if you want to take the lead. Answers, Question five. Career <laughs> rushing touchdowns. You know Matt Ryan's uh, a great rushing quarterback, guys. You know, he's one of the elite rushers of his generation. How many rushing touchdowns did he have? Too many. Take your time. <laughs> what a drastic change. <laughs> it matters. These things matter. <laughs> All about the detail. Are you good? Yeah, whatever. Why the switch? I was trying to do, you know, kind of kind of take his total years. And I figured 
was probably averaging about one a year, but then I know he had a couple of years where he was probably in like the three ish range. So I counted for multi years, but he probably okay. had some years with zero. Let's just, let's just uh, cut to the chase and reveal. Yeah, don't ask me to explain these things. 17, 21, 18. Oh, man. Correct answer wow. is 13. Go! Point for Nick. Score is now th- J Mo with three, Nick with two, Gut with one. What did I have? A, I had 18 or si- I had 16 originally, right? And I changed it to 17. Yes. So you would have been even closer. Not a lot. Question six. How many regular seasons wins does Matt Ryan have in his career? Around for a minute. Played for the Falcons. A lot of wins. Seeing unbelievable things on this board. <laughs> things I would never want to show my worst enemy. Is that your answer? It doesn't It doesn't feel good. All right. Yeah, fuck it. Let's reveal. 77, 108, 104. Ooh. Correct answer. 124. Damn. Put some respect on Matt Ryan's name. Oh. Point for gut. What scores was I doing? So we had what? Two, two, three? Two, two, yeah. three. Should Gutter Nick get this right, we're going to have to come up with a little overtime question, which moves us to. Oh, I did. S- oh, I'm season so high stupid. in passing yards for Matt Ryan. Okay. Everybody got an answer? Let's reveal. I think mine's so wrong. Nick with 46.85. Gut with 46.50. JMO with 47.50. Oh, shit. We're close, oh, Gut. Lord. The correct answer, 49-44. J-Mo gets Dude, the point and gets the win. Matt Ryan was an MVP, Damn. boys. Almost threw was for that, 5K. I, yeah, th- I felt like that year? MVP year was like, was I, I thought statistically it was, it was kind of a down year. Just like in general for what the MVP was. I believe was it was also his, his high in passing touchdowns too. Mm-hmm. 49-44, 38 touchdowns all in the same year. Well, I'm embarrassed. J-Mo gets the win. Close one, though. It was. That was, it was very competitive. That's what you like to see when, every, when all the boys come to play. Welcome back to another edition of Office Trivia. We got a head-to-head matchup today between Gut and J-Mo. A little intern takeover. Boys, we got a fantasy draft for you guys today. It's cat teams only. Jaguars, Bengals, Lions, Panthers. A couple college teams. LSU and Penn State. Gut, those are your boys over there, Penn State. I know. Cat. Kerry Collins is on the list. Excuse me? Oh, that's true. Oh, right. What was Kerry's MVP year? It was a couple, right? Uh, yeah, there's a few in there. Kerry was a dog. Right, in hold college, on. he was a dog. Fuck out, guys. Boys, you ready to jump right into the game here today? I'm ready to jump high. Ready to jump high. That's what I like to hear. I mean, J-Mo, we'll start with you. Name. That is super flex. It just says flex. I'll throw a... Ooh, it is super flex. All right. That makes it more interesting. All right. There they are. 2019 Christian McCaffrey. 2019 Christian McCaffrey. I hope so. Confident that he was alive that year? He was alive. Was breathing. Don't know if he had a kneecap, but... All right, Christian McCaffrey, 2019, 411.2 points. That's... Damn. That's a lot of points. That is a ton of points. Give me 2015 Cam. 2015 Cameron Newton. MVP. Sticking with the Panthers. 2015 Cam Newton. 399.1. One. Yeah. Okay. That's a lot. That's also a ton of points. Got a second pick from you. Keep in mind, it does not have to be a Carolina Panther. Panthers. Uh, 20, 2011 Calvin Johnson. 2011 Calvin Johnson. A gut favorite. It is my favorite. Calvin Johnson, 2011. 311.2 points. Maybe uh, we should bust out the Bill hey, Bell. Cal? Penn State, guess. Thoughts? Remember that? Bust out what? Bill Bell. Penn State, running back. Remember that? I will go with Penn State, though. 2018, Saquon Barkley. 2018, Saquon Barkley. His rookie I year. I thought you were going Allen Robinson. The rook. What? Why not? It would have been fun if I like, mandated you had to take a player from all these teams. I feel like the only one we won't really touch is the Jags. Saquon in 2018, rookie year, 338. Point three. That's a little three piece. You back to back though, right? Okay. And then I will take 2022 Justin Jefferson. 2022 Justin Jefferson. Oh, lot LSU. The LSU oh. pick. Gotta make sure you stay on top of these things. Go up. 2022 Justin Jefferson. 301.3 points. Not bad. Could have done a little better than Calvin, but that's okay. <laughs> Give me 2011 Matt Stafford. 2011 Matt Stafford with, with confidence. I love 5K it. 5K yards. I know yeah. he has good points. It's, I don't think it's anything too crazy though. I think it's like 320 or something. Or something. I'll take it. That says it's like 320 or something. Or some. 2011 Matt Stafford or some. How about 355.3? Damn. I know. 5K yards. Way through a ton of picks. 355.3. Not bad. Um, take the lead back. I don't know which year it was this big year. It was just so tough. I don't really want to play risky here. Um, Never would want to do that. All right. Give me a... Uh, I'll go safe. Give me last year Jamar Chase. Last year Jamar Chase. Yeah. Well, Jamar last Chase. year's last was bad. Jamar Chase? He was injured, missed a few games. 200.9. Not bad. Damn. But his rookie year, he was healthy. Yeah, that is I facts. don't remember. I thought he was like, why does he have four I guess points per game? Fuck, that sucks. I don't have another receiver, so don't say anything. I All right. Is it my turn? Yeah, you can say that. So bad. <laughs> I'll take last year's Joe Burrow. Last year's Joe. But, but I want him as an LSU Burrow. player. Thank you for making the decision. 
That fucking sucks. Oh my god. So hey, don't fold. Don't don't. That, I know that C four is starting to wear off. Don't don't fold on me. Joe Burrow last year three fifty six point seven. Okay, Joe. Joe Burr. Joe Burr. Hey, this is still a ball game. This is still a ball game. I don't want to get penalized for asking this. I think it's a fair question. I'm not going to penalize you for asking. Can I d- draft TJ Hawkinson as a lion last year? Or Ooh. do I only get him for fucking six games? Because mm. he doesn't count under both. It's a question. I'm going to have to make a ruling on this. It is a question for yeah. the host. My official ruling as acting commissioner, I'm going to say I'm going to say no. I'm going to say you can't have him. Okay. I feel like we counted it. <laughs> Unless you want to, you can count his Lions points. We counted it before because I had it was NFC North and I had uh, Vikings. Count his Lions NFC. points. Yeah, we won't be doing it. <laughs> Lions good, points only. Before though? I will take then 2015 Greg Olson. 2015 Gerg. Yes, Gerg. <laughs> How many points did Gerg have in 2015? No, not Greg Odin. And Greg could you Olsen. tell me if that's his best year? I feel like he might have a better one, to be I'd honest. I'd be happy to tell you. I think he did have a better one, but that's the most consistent one to go with MVP. Yeah. 2015 was his best year. Was it? 188.9. Go Gerg. After that Jamar pick. Don't fold, gut. I don't Don't you dare folding, fold on me. I still have some picks. Give me 1995 Barry Sanders. Like it. That's, Woo! that's how you Let's get back in. That's I have no idea. That's something I would do, gut, and I love it. I've uh, thought of it. I'm like, I'm not. I've seen Matt miss too much, and I'm not gonna do like I'm better. I might as well go down swinging right now. Right, so I'm not, I, I think I'm gonna have to do a manual calculation here. Yeah, you do. It's before 2000. 1500 on the ground. It's actually low for Barry. His best year was 97. Definitely, he ran for 2K that year. He did have 48 catches in 1995, which is his highest. So hold on. 1500 yards. Plus 150. We have 398 receiving yards. So that's 38.9. No, 39.8. We have 12 total touchdowns. That's 72. And then 48 receptions. So that's 24. Barry had 285.8. That's pretty good. It's fucking ass. Ass, Barry. Don't, don't fold so easily. That was already a pretty full court shot. I mean, Shut up. You how, much more, plank. how much more full, full court shot does he get? Well, I, I can't even go, think of I one. Could, I could go 1970s Franco Harris, but I'm not going. Not going. That would be a you move. I can't. Nail a year. So I'm going to I not can't either. <laughs> <laughs> what was the immaculate catch? <laughs> That's, I might as well go ballsy at least a little bit. Uh, give me 2018 Leonard Fournette. 2018 Lenny. I think that was his best year. He's drafted in 17. Dude, Jamar Chase is like going to bother me my core. I didn't even think about it. I was like, oh, points per game. He was like fourth. And I'm like, wait a minute. Sorry, right, man. Lenny, 2018. Only played eight games. Damn. Was 2017 his good year? Uh, was going between those two years. 17 and 19 were both good. Even uh, 21 was good with Tampa. My brain's out. It's fine. Yeah, eight games, 109.4. Yep, I'm just commit. It's fine. Let's close this out with dignity here, boys. So I'm going to go back to Carson Palmer. But uh, I remember when me and you played the other day, I tried looking up his best year. I think it's 05. Okay. I'm going to lock that in. Lock it in. But you never know. It was like a fine year. It wasn't anything special, I feel like. But everyone's just like, and it's not even ingrained in anyone's head. We keep missing the year. Carson Palmer, 05, 275.8. We'll get the job done. Doesn't need the tight end. Oh, I get another receiver. You have a receiver still, yeah. Uh, it's fucking a watch. Give me last year's T. Higgins. Last year's T. Higgins. Feels a little safe. Maybe we could have done something a little more creative there. I'm going to get creative? Nah, it's too late. T. Higgins already been locked in. Not going to get any style right. points, but you will get 181.9 points. Oh, wow. I mean, that's not bad. I'll got a tight end that closes out here. Give me 2020 Mike Kosicki. 2020 in the towel. Mike Kosicki. Every, every time he has a C4, I'm tossing it. It's Let's see those Mike Kosicki numbers. Remember, Mike Kosicki, Penn State, for those of you at home being like, Mike Kosicki's not a cat. He scored 132.8. That's It's a respectable finish there. Put it on the board. Fucking Ornette, goddamn Jamar Chase. Okay, we're going to be all right. We're going to get through this together Dude, as a company. I'm on as, as company. friends. I'm on the, I'm on the last J-Mo, show. another win. Oh How's it feel? Feels great. Feel beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> you better watch his No better way to end the video. Feel great, brother.